All right, YouTube, listen up. Off-Road Yo-Yo here with another Yo-Yo review. Or should I say a return top review? Today, we're taking a look at a recent release from CLYW, a Canadian company that doesn't use the word Yo-Yo. In fact, I don't think anybody in Canada says Yo-Yo. They call them return tops. Tops because they spin and return because they return to your hand. An adorable, simple people, the Canadians. Anyway, this return top looks like this, and it's called the Bear Trap. The Bear Trap is exceptionally weird looking, to the point of making me mildly uncomfortable. It's not that it's uncomfortable in the hand, it's just that these holes on the side kind of make me emotionally uncomfortable. I, d I don't... I don't want to stick my finger in the trap hole. Due to our intense level of emotional discomfort with this, we're going to introduce a new segment called Off-Road Yo-Yo's Targeted Review. Thank you for calling Cleveland West Target Store. Our hours have changed for the holidays. To view specific holiday I don't hours, care. please go to Target.com or the Target app. For hours and location information, press 1. To reach a specific department, press 2. To speak to someone in the pharmacy, press 3. A uh, specific department, please? For electronics, press 1. No. For the guest service desk, press 2. Maybe. For food and beverage, press 3. No. For apparel and accessories, press 4. No. For HR, press 5. HR? For Starbucks, press 6. No. For wine, beer, and spirits, Press 7. Maybe later. For toys, press 8. Kind of. For all other departments, press 9. We'll go to toys. Hello, this is Susie at Target. Yes, hello. I recently bought a yo-yo, um, and it has a weird hole in it. Um, I would say bring it up and talk to guest services. Can I talk to them now? Um, I really don't know how to transfer the phone. I am a new, uh, associate here. <laughs> oh, just starting for the holidays, huh? Yeah. Okay, I understand. Thank you for your time. Uh, okay, have a great day. You too. She was worthless. Thank you for calling Cleveland West Target Store. Our hours have changed for the holidays. To view specific I know. holiday hours... Please go to Target.com we or the here. Target app. For the guest service desk, press 2. There we For go. Target guest service, this is Tina. I can help you find. Hello. I recently bought a yo-yo, and it has a weird hole in it. Do you have the receipt or the card you paid with? Excuse me? Do you have the receipt or the card you paid with? I do have a receipt, yes. Sure. You'd be able to bring that in 90 days with receipt, 120 if you bought it with a red card. Okay, I just bring my yo-yo to you and you will explain this hole to me? Mm-hmm. Okay, great. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye-bye. She was worthless, too. So Off-Road Yo-Yo's targeted review didn't really go all that well. We're going to have to tackle this weird hole all by ourselves. So... Here we go. Modern society has lots of different super commitments that they make that they can't ever, ever break. Harry Potter has the unbreakable vow. Wookiees have the Wookiee life debt. Klingons have the Klingon blood oath. All these super mega promises that the people make that they would never break, sometimes with consequence of death. Yo-yo companies have a similar super powerful commitment that they make which is called the arbitrary decision to forever retire a good yo-yo model. CLYW has done it several times, and one of which is the Chief. The Chief is a yo-yo that CLYW used to make a long time ago, but they don't make it anymore because it's retired. However, they bring it up over and over and over again when they make new yo-yos because truth be told, the Chief is pretty great, and the Bear Trap is another one of those influenced return tops. Ugh. In the original write-up for the bear trap, 
CLYW stated that they wanted to recapture the good things about the Chief with some neat things of a yo-yo that didn't quite make it off the production floor. They prototyped it, they proved that it couldn't possibly work, but they didn't want to give up on it. And thus, this was born. So, about the bear trap, it uh, 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 hey, here's some. The bear trap is not a signature throw. CLYW loves making signature throws for the various members of their team, which makes sense because they have a big team. In fact, let me put this away. I've got one here for you now. Yeah, here's one. This is the Kodiak. The Kodiak is a signature return top of Tessa Piccillo. She won the World's Women Championship in 2017 over there in Iceland. She used this yo-yo to do it. Not this exact one that I'm holding. This one's mine. I bought this one fair and square from a store. She's got her own. She doesn't need mine. She's got her own. But it probably would be pretty cool to have hers. In fact, if I wanted to get a hold of hers, I might use a bear trap. <laughs> Do you get it? You get it? Because it's a, a Kodiak is a kind of bear. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> That's uh, sad. <clears throat> if you look deep inside the bear trap's trap hole, you'll see an image of a bear trap. There's a bear trap waiting inside the bear traps trap hole and you want me to put my finger in there did you notice that there's also like a point in there why would i ever put my oh, i really want to i real i i mm, change the subject again you know speaking of the whole bear trap and kodiak thing this might be the first time that clyw released a return top with the name of something that can attack and capture the name of one of their other yo-yos. You know what I mean? Like uh, the Orca. I don't think they're gonna make a whaling boat yo-yo. Or uh, the Puffin. What eats, what eats Puffins? They do have bear versus man, right? That kind of, that's just straight up conflict right from the get-go. Bear versus man. We're gonna fight. My money's on the bear. If you compare a bear to like a man, a bear is, Ah, it's got fur and claws and, you know, those teeth. Man, man, yeah, a man's just some dude. Now, if he has a bear trap, he might have something going for him. Maybe that's where it came from. I mean, do you, do you dare? I don't want to do it. Does it make you uncomfortable? So far, the bear trap only comes in solid colors, which is fine because those colors happen to be great. I mean, look at this one. It's great. And though I have some theories as to why they're only available in solid colors, I can't know for sure because I've never been invited into the musty, dark, evil black magic laboratory in which they created this abomination. Fortunately, if you find yourself paralyzed with nervous energy every time you stare within the dark, inviting depths of the bear trap's trap hole, you can simply throw it as it was intended and you don't have to focus on it. Though if you do focus on it, you kind of, um, you kind of, you just, the disturbing and terrifying trap hole is actually really difficult to see when you do hardcore tricks like the pinwheel. You know, there are some people that will say that this trap hole is actually really good for finger spins, but those people <laughs> aren't your friend and they should not be trusted. Okay, I think this review is going pretty well so far. Uh, we've covered the name and uh, the hole. Yeah, I don't think I'm missing anything. You can hear other voices in the background, and that's fine. This is everybody's woods. But this particular part of the woods, this part's mine. These are my woods right here. They can have those woods. These are my woods. Their woods, my woods. You know what? I bet this thing can catch gummy bears. Oh yeah, all day long. You can put gummy bears in that hole, and you can put gummy bears in that hole. If you're so motivated, you could cram a worm in the trap hole. If you like this review, please hit the like and subscribe button. That does a lot for us, and we really dig it when you do that. If you didn't like this review, 
that's fine. You don't have to do anything. Or you can even click the thummy downy thing if you want. You do what you want. It's a free woods. Oh yeah, as for like how the yo-yo plays and stuff, it's really good. Okay, 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 okay. That's not bad. Yeah, that's... That's fine. I could have been doing this the whole time. <laughs> Am I being mean? It's not an abomination. It's wonderful. I wonder if mentioning the Kodiak and saying Tessa's name in the video will get her to say hi in the comments. That would be... Oh, that, we'd be done. We'd pack it. We'd be done. Mission accomplished. Everything that we set out to do would be... We'd, we'd be done.